<laughs> In this video, let's see why you need a Lutron Right to Select system. If you're an interior designer, architect, or even an end user, this video is for you to demonstrate the principle of this fantastic lighting control system. We'll use a bedroom as an example. You will then be able to apply this knowledge to any other room in your project and even to extend it to your entire home. So without any further ado, <laughs> let's do it. Let's say that you have this bedroom here, for example, where, as you can see, the lighting is not great. You just have a single pendant in the middle of the room, controlled only from that switch here by the door. Some areas are quite dark and dull overall. And although you may be able to control the bedside lamps locally by the bed, every time you want to turn off the room before to go to sleep, you have to walk all the way back to the door to switch the main light off. That is really not convenient. You have to upgrade the lighting here, add a bit of vavavoom, like for example, add a circuit of dimmable downlight here to eliminate the entrance and around the bed. Add another circuit for a dimmable LED strip in a curtain box. This looks great. Illuminate the shelves here so you can make it as a nice display. And even add some low-level lighting that you can use at night time. You see, this is looking much better now. So, let's say you decide to rewire the room. How are you going to control the lights? Are you going to end up with a massive bunch of switches by the main door? And also by your bedside? No. This is not the solution. You deserve better than this. Here, you need a Lutron Ratu Select system. You don't know how this works? Well, let me give you a quick overview on how to implement this fantastic wireless lighting control solution in any room. But before we go any further, this video is sponsored by Adelex. Yes. <laughs> That's right, this is us. Based in the UK, we've got over 18 years of experience with Lutron lighting control all over the world. We are specialized in high-end residential where we design, supply, and program Lutron systems such as Lutron Homeworks, Lutron Ratu Select, and Lutron Blinds and Curtains. We work directly with end users but also with architects and lighting designers, electrical contractors, and smart home AV specialists. So if you also want to take your current lighting control project to the next level and be looked after by a reputable Lutron professional, feel free to get in touch with us now. Contact details in the comment section below. Okay, let's go back to our tutorial. Take your light, or more precisely your lighting circuit, which is a set of light fittings wired together. Now, get a Lutron wireless inline dimmer, and there's different versions available depending on the type of light you're using, like mains dimmable, 0 to 10 volt, or switch. On one end, wire your lighting circuit to it, and on the other, wire that Lutron module to your 230 volt mains feed coming from your distribution panel. And you can refer to one of my previous videos for the wiring of that Lutron inline dimmer. All the lights wired to the same inline dimmer will be able to turn on, dim, and turn off all together. 
Now, the good thing is that you can add another lighting circuit, like an LED strip to use in your curtain box and use another Lutron dimmer. And then add any additional lighting circuits to improve the look of your room. Now, Lutron dimmers can be installed and spread around the room, like in a void above your ceiling, for example. Or you can centralize them in a specific location and fit them in a plastic enclosure, for example, or any other method of choice, as you can see here in those examples. Now, to operate your lights, you will use Lutron Picos. Really, a Pico is a small remote control fitted in a faceplate that you can install in place of your traditional switches or to any other location where you want to control your light and it doesn't require any wiring on the back of it. Great! <laughs> for example here, I'll have one Pico by my bedroom door for when I enter the room and one on each side of the bed for optimal convenience. Now, check this out. Using Lutron Wireless Communication Protocol called Clear Connect, each Pico can talk to all my Lutron inline dimmers in the room and therefore will operate my light using lighting scenes. By using Picos, I've eliminated the need for traditional switches for each lighting circuit and offer my clients a very convenient way to operate their light. That is super cool. <laughs> The communication of this entire Lutron Ratu Select system is orchestrated via the Lutron Ratu Select main repeater here. You need one main repeater per Ratu Select system, which can control up to 99 Lutron wireless devices within a radius of 9 meter, which is ideal to control multiple rooms. And if you need more information on how to design a Ratu Select system, for an entire house, you can refer to this tutorial here, available on my channel. Now, to program your entire Lutron wireless system, connect your main repeater to your home network and then use the Lutron app on your phone. From there, you will program your lighting scenes and any other cool features that the Lutron Ratu Select offers, like adding new Lutron devices, when you decide to extend your system, program time clocks or the integration with other smart home systems. Et voilà! <laughs> and if you enjoyed this video so far, make sure to give it a thumbs up and smash the subscribe button and share it with your friends and colleagues and family, as this will help the channel to continue making those kind of tutorials. Merci beaucoup. Going back to our bedroom and the wiring of our Lutron Ratu Select. Let's say that somewhere here at the back of my wardrobe, I will fit a small plastic enclosure that contains all my Lutron wireless inline dimmers. Each dimmer will be wired to its corresponding lighting circuit on one end, downlight, pendant, LED strip, etc. And on the other end, they will be fed directly from my distribution panel, as you can see here. Next, I would have my Lutron Ratu Select main repeater fitted in the vicinity of my Lutron equipment. Remember, a single main repeater can control multiple rooms if you wish to. That repeater will have to be connected to your home Wi-Fi router to allow us to set up the system program scenes and for the full control of your Lutron system from the Lutron app. OK. Now, by the bedroom door here, I will install a Lutron wireless PicoSync keypad. So again, no wiring needed here. And I will fit the same type of Pico on each side of the bed for maximum convenience. The wireless Picos will operate the wireless dimmers thanks to the main repeater and the programming done on the Lutron app. So, let's say for example that from those three Pico locations, I can turn all the lighting circuits to full on from the top button. 
from the second button, I can activate the relax scene to use at the end of the day to wind down or watch TV. Very nice. The third button can activate your night scene to go to the bathroom in the middle of the night or if you don't want to wake up your partner when you enter the room. Very cool. And finally, use the bottom button to switch all the light off. Very convenient, especially from your bedsides. Now, if you've been wondering, your bedside lamps as well as your floor lamps can also be part of your Lutron Ratu Select system. Each lamp will just have to be connected to a Lutron wireless plug-in lamp dimmer so you can make them as part of your lighting scenes. And using a simple Pico remote on a pedestal, for example, you can have individual control for each of them. Isn't that great? <laughs> we even have a video about that plug-in lamp dimmer if you want to know more about it. <laughs> voilà, there you have it. Why you need a Lutron Ratu Select system to easily enhance the lighting in your rooms as well as adding convenience. I hope you find this video useful and if you have any question, please let me know in the comment section below. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe to the Adelux YouTube channel so you can be updated when the next video is released. Thank you very much. Good luck and talk to you again <laughs> on the next tutorial.